What's up, you guys? What's up to all my Transformers out there, all my little Transform Hers and Transform Hems and Transform Thems? How y'all doing out there today? It's your girl, Tiffany, and I'm back at it with another video for your screen, for your TV screen, for your phone screen, your laptop screen, however you guys watch YouTube. I'm on it. So, I'm not going to keep dragging this video on and on. I know you guys read by the title by now, because if you didn't, you wouldn't have clicked, or maybe it was just my little cute face or my poetic justice shirt. I don't know why you clicked. But if you don't know by now, this right here is just seven things that I am manifesting these 365 days into next year uh, from the big 40th birthday. Um, this year, you guys, even though I'm only turning 39, just a little bit seasoned than I was last year, I really don't want any gifts. Um, I'm going to cancel mostly all my appointments, like my hair appointment, my nail appointment. Um, I have an eyelash appointment on Saturday. I might keep that just because I am so committed about getting my lashes done every three weeks. Been doing that for the last couple of years. So I probably keep my eyelashes. But other than that, you guys, it's just another birthday. Um, just me being on this positive energy vibe that I've been on for the last 10 months. I just really realized it's really not about me. So for the next year, I'm just going to help people celebrate their birthday and just keep doing what I got to do. So stick along, go ahead, like, comment, subscribe, tap in with your girl, let me know what's up, and stick to the video. Like I say, you guys might be disappointed or you might not. I hope you might not. Alright? Alright. So the first thing that's on my list, and I'm actually doing it right now, is a YouTuber. Um, when I first decided to do YouTube years ago, it was going to be me and my babe who was going to do a couples channel. And if you guys haven't seen the video where we did the eat it, smell it, wear it challenge, where we did it, I think it was in 2017, 2018, I don't know. It was years ago. Um, where I was trying to hide my kids. They were babies. My oldest son was in high school. But I didn't want to go that route, you guys. I didn't want to do challenges, pranks. First of all, I'm too old for that. Second of all, I'm goofy. So doing pranks, I'm, it's not going to work. I got to stop being so goofy. And third of all, I just wanted my kids to be kids. I didn't want to wake them up with a camera in their face. That's it. That's all. And then even though I was ready, I mean, even though I was willing, I wasn't ready. You get what I'm saying? I was willing to do YouTube, but I wasn't ready. Now, I'm ready. So that's the first thing that I'm, I'm manifesting, uh, which I'm already doing YouTube, but the thing that I'm manifesting that I at least get to maybe 100 to 200 subscribers um, by this time next year, that'd be nice. Um, I'm not trying to go viral. I'm not trying to be popular. I'm not trying to just do stuff for my channel just to blow up. What you guys will see, you guys will see as my videos progress, why, when, who, and why I'm doing it the way I'm doing it. But yes. That's the number one thing. I have manifested it for years, and now I'm doing it. <laughs> That's why I'm on y'all's screen. All right, okay. All right, little Transformers. Uh, so the second thing that's on my manifesting list that I already started, I actually been doing this for a couple of weeks, almost maybe two months now, and I just found out something yesterday when I was uh, writing it. Um, I'm actually coming out with my first erotic sexual book is going to be called good girls bad attentions and it's going it's going to be something to die for um i don't know if i'm gonna send these books to people in prison uh because it's very very uh, yeah so i'm not gonna to say too much but yes please look out for that book i will be dropping it on uh it will be an ebook first and then within weeks later we'll put it out on paperback and hardback but that should be dropping spring of 2022. And like I said, it's called Good Girls, Bad Attention. It's a sex book. It's getting down and dirty. It's pretty much trying to tell women to love themselves. Um, and once you love yourself, you can love others. But love yourself sexually. Don't want to say too much, but look out for that book. All right? So that's the second thing. Okay. So the third thing that's on this list, and I have said these, this in my previous videos. I think the last two, three previous videos I have mentioned this. And this will be coming out this holiday. It will be called the Antidote Podcast. And the Antidote Podcast, I'm just going to be talking about life experiences from the cradle to the grave. So it's going to be all kinds of life experiences. That's one thing that I'm trying to bring to this channel. My life experience my life pain that'll probably help people you know um sometimes you could go through stuff and you could go down one way or you could go through the other way fortunately i went this way and that's why my life is good um but i could have went the other way 
So that's why I'm coming out with the Any Dope Podcast. And the reason it's called the Any Dope Podcast because I am Any Dope. You get it? Ain't I Dope? And then Any Dope is like medicine. So that's why it will be called the Any Dope Podcast. So it is Pat now. Don't nobody steal that name. Look out for that podcast. It will be on your iTunes, Apple, everything. Trust me. So that will be coming either before Thanksgiving or right before Christmas. The Any Dope Podcast. Check that out. That is the second thing. Oh no, that's the third thing. We on number three. We is getting down to business. So the fourth thing that I have manifested, and I also have been working on this. Um, I'm actually on this program, TheMastermind.com, with uh, Dean and Tony Robinson, and I'm going to be putting on a, uh, putting out an online program. I don't know if I'm going to do an online program to where I'm teaching women how to love yourself or if I'm going to do an online program to where I'm teaching people how to co-parent. I mean, there's so many things I have went through in life that I can show other people, but I'm going to charge. So that's the next thing that I'm supposed to be doing. That will be dropping January, February 2022. I can actually drop it now, but it's not ready. I'm not trying to rush through things. So look for that. It's an online course. I don't know how much I'm going to charge for that yet. Um, basically, the information that I'm giving out is priceless. So I can charge anywhere from $100 to $1,000. So I'm still on the pricing thing with that. I'm talking to my mentors about that. But yeah, look out for that. It's an online course. Still trying to figure out my niche niche with that. I don't know if I want to help women, help men, single mothers. I don't know. But just look out for that. All right. So that is the fourth thing that your girl is manifesting. And I swear, by the time I turn 40, all these things, if not two of these things, or one of these things, will be successful. Trust me. All right. So the next thing that's on my list, and it's not really making money. It's probably going to be a little side job, but it's more of what I want to do for my community. Um, even though um, I already have started this, if you guys haven't seen in my previous videos where I had the short wig, that was a lace front, and a couple of curly wigs are a lace front. So I have got into the business of making lace fronts. Um, I have the little magnet, the little mannequin head, and all that good stuff. I started that like the beginning of uh, of quarantine when the COVID started happening. Just watching a lot of YouTube videos. I went to first buy my first hair, and then I bought the lace, and then I bought the frontal. So I have made wigs. Um, I'm getting better in time. But what I want to do with that business idea is I want to help women who have maybe went through a breakup or uh, are going to a new job or women who are sick or anything I want it's pretty much going to be a non-profit business where I'm helping women just feel better about yourself just intensifying the fact even single mothers you know who don't have the money or the means to get their hair done you come to me i'm going to hook you up so you guys will see more of my wig making throughout the year i'm gonna show you guys but that's one thing i am manifesting i'm gonna give back because i have been that single mother i have been that girl who thought uh don't nobody care which a lot of people don't but that's all right as long as you love yourself love you that's all that matters if you love you and god love you who else could be against you? And if they is against you, they not for you. So that whole wig thing, I would definitely tell you guys more about that because that's going to be a dream of mine. And I mean, I'm going to make some nice wigs and I'm basically going to give them away. You know, let you guys know more about that. But yeah, that's the thing that I'm going to do. That's number five. Okay, so we are down to our number six thing. On my list of things that I'm manifesting, um, things that will come to pass, you know, I try not to put all my eggs in one basket, especially when it's a million baskets out there, you know, trying to sort them out. But this business right here, um, we already have the stuff set up for it. I don't know if I showed you this stuff, this stuff yet on my um, on my previous videos, but we already have a t-shirt printer. We already have the uh, vinyl cutter. We have two, three computers in here, and this is going to be me and my king's business. But he came up with the name, and it's called Arrogant. So we're going to come out with an arrogant clothing line, where we're going to only focus on shirts and hats and hoodies and sweaters of that things but the hat's going to match the shirt the shirt's going to match the hat the sweater is going to match the hat like it's going to all be it's going to all be 
legit put it like that so yes it's going to be called arrogant a-r-r-g-a-n-t i don't know if he's going to uh maybe not spell it that way but yeah so don't steal that name i am patenting that right now on this video y'all arrogant clothing line will be coming out we got a lot to talk about about that about how we're gonna go through that so we really haven't came up with a date or a year that is going to be coming out but look for that within these 365 days yeah so look for them clothes arrogant clothing line coming to a store near you hey 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 oh, so we are down to our seventh thing seventh thing we are at the end your girl needs some nails i ain't been wearing no nails looking like a little boy but anyways we're down to the seventh thing on my list and this right here you guys if you guys haven't seen the video where uh where i did my shopping haul where i bought some tiana taylor i bought my little cousin she came out with a bra and penny uh line and at the end of that video i kind of sort of somewhat told you guys i uh pretty much put into myself and my bay it's this business idea that we've been thinking about for years uh we've been together nine and a half years i think we started thinking about this when we was together about two years so about seven years we've been sitting on this idea but in the midst of me making youtube in the midst of him doing his thing in the midst of us raising kids and the midst of us moving from this place to this place to this house to this house this dream kind of got put on the back burner but it was always in my heart always in his heart um is no other business like this trust me but the name of this business will be called buddy couples i will not tell you guys anymore because buddy couples is like a newborn baby to us you know how you have a newborn baby and you protect that newborn baby at all you know at all costs and then when you do start having people come over and look at your newborn baby and they like oh this baby's cute oh look at the little cute baby and then when that person leave and then they on the phone and now they're talking about the baby oh the baby's not that cute oh the baby doesn't look like the dad oh did you see the baby did you see? you know just all that fakeness yeah that's why i'm not going to tell too much about buddy couples but look out for that it's already llc already registered um I will, me and my family, will be leaving California within the next 12 months. So I don't know if I want to open up a storefront here or if I want to open up a storefront where we move. Not going to tell you guys where we move. If you don't know by now, you just don't know by now. I know I have mentioned it in my videos. But yeah, um, so that's it. That's it of this video. Go ahead, like, comment, subscribe, and just let you guys know that you have to manifest what you want in your life. Stop telling people your dreams. You don't need a poll. You don't need advice. Do what's in your heart. And if people don't like you, if they're not for you, then they're just not for you. Get them people out your life. You know what you need to do. You and God know what you need to do. And that's all that matters. And not only will I have at least five of these seven businesses down packed, I will have two high school graduates. And I was a single mom. I was a single teenage mom. So won't God do it? Yes, he will. So go ahead. Like I said before, tap in with your girl. And until tomorrow, until y'all see my face again, y'all do you. Because can't nobody else be you but you. It don't even look right if somebody else is doing they can't be you. Can't nobody be me. I can't be you. You can't be me. Because you you. Right? Alright. So, tap in and...